we know it's been a long time, so before you guys trample us for being gone for so long, um, we promise it's been well worth the wait because we have some pretty good news for you guys. So we've been gone for a while because... Well, we've been working and yeah. we've been uh, going to school. You've been going to school and uh, we went out of town a couple weeks ago and we got engaged. That's engaged. the big news. <laughs> I know, it's like work, okay. <laughs> no, we got engaged. So um, a lot of you guys have been asking and you know, poking in like, what's oh, taking so long? So here it is. Um, now I know from here, you guys are not really going to be able to see the ring. Um, so I make sure to kind of post a picture somewhere up here showing you guys, but he did a great job. I'm super happy with it. And what's that? He did a great job and I'm super happy with it. I'm glad. <laughs> I know. I'm glad. So we um, anticipate getting a lot of questions about, you know, who, what, where, when. So we wanted to kind of jot those down for you guys. If you see us looking down, we just have it on some stickies. And we're going to go through those for you. Whoa. <laughs> yes. All right. So <laughs> the first question is, why did we wait so long? We get this question Is that a, a question for me? I guess it is a question. Yeah, people always ask me. And I'm like, what? <laughs> okay, I guess I'm going to get on the knee and propose to him. But no, we talk about everything. I'm sure you guys know. We're really good at communicating and we're also very business minded. So a lot of the decisions we make, we think about costs, number one, costs yep. and time. And so for us, it was, you know, do we want to live in an apartment for the next four or five years because we got some crazy ring that we had to finance or do we get a house, build that investment and that equity and then look at a ring? Yep. I wish I could have done everything at the same time, but it wasn't, uh, yeah. uh wasn't in my pocketbook. So. <laughs> and as far as the specific timing, um, we went to New York for a business trip, Sheena did, and I went up there, I kind of piggybacked, and we took a few extra days, and Sheena's originally from New York, so it was planned out to propose at some point during our trip. We were there for five days, and I carried it around in my pocket for what, four? Yeah. Four, three and a half, four days, waiting for the right moment. So um, anyway, that was kind of uh, where we've been. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. And I, I was totally surprised. It, it was great. The planning was awesome. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. It's hard to keep a secret, though. I got to tell you, I bought it before we went out of town, and I traveled with it, and I had it in my pocket for I don't know how we part. kept that I'm from just... me, because I know everything. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. all-knowing Sheena. So she, was, she was stunned. He did a good job. I think yeah. I was more, like, just surprised that he was able to keep it from me, I think. I think that's where most of the tears that came from. That was the hardest part. Yeah. I even called him like sneaky von crying. I'm like, you're just so sneaky. <laughs> we actually, we were kind of going around just kind of enjoying the city, but we wanted to do some tourist-like thing. So he really wanted to go on top of Fairy Rock. I didn't know what his intentions were at that point, but he really wanted to go at sunset. So we ended up going up there around like seven and it was gorgeous. And just, I mean, I'm from New York and I've never been on top of 30 Rock. It's just not something we did. So I truly enjoyed it. It was fun. It wasn't too cold and yeah, everything was perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, I was afraid I was going to screw it up. Yeah, he was nervous. Uh, next question is, is, is there anything different? I would say no, and I think that's why we were not rushing to do the whole process of getting the ring because we knew nothing would change. It's like, just because we have a ring does not mean like we're going to go into like bridezilla mode and like, you know, I'm so simple. I don't care. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sweating. But yeah. yeah, I don't, like nothing has really changed. We're still the same couple. We're still doing our thing. It's just now we have something else in the equation to look forward sure. to, you know? And I know when she's walking around, like when she's at school or whatever, it's like mosquito repellent. Like, <laughs> stay away, dudes. <laughs> Off. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey, girl, what's up? Uh, he loves it. I do. Claiming, I guess. But, and, uh, you know, you girls out there with the rings, you know it doesn't matter when these dudes hit on you. They see the ring, they're like, it don't matter. What about uh, kids? We've talked about kids before. I'm going to do the hard eye roll on you guys. I don't know why everyone assumes that once you get engaged, once you get married, like, oh, she must be pregnant now, or the kids are coming. Both of those are negative. We're not, no. Uh, it's about us. We as a unit, we're very happy just being together. Um, so we're not going to rush that process whatsoever. Like I said, nothing has changed. We still have the same goals in mind. We still want to own our own business 100% and be entrepreneurs. And you can't do that when you rush kids into the equation. Yep. And I still have to finish school. So it's just not on the radar. Well, I think it's nice when you see parents that have planned kids and they have money set aside for tuition and yeah. for even uh, private schools or whatever. Um, yeah. We don't know what 
all that will look like in a few, I guess, whenever we decide to have children, but we want to make sure we want to plan it. Yeah. So they have a good childhood. And they have all the opportunities they want and money is not a reason that they're held back from, you know, chasing their dreams and their passions. Yeah. And we didn't grow up rich. We didn't grow up like, you know, impoverished, but we, we didn't have really wealthy parents. So some things, you know, we had to hear no. And I want to be at a place where if my kid wants to play soccer and violin and everything at the same time, I can afford to allow them to do that and put them in a charter school, you know? Yeah. So no rush. Stay tuned. But of course you guys will know. <laughs> <laughs> um, when is the ceremony? That's a great question. Yeah. So uh, I'll, I'll answer this. Mm, yeah. We're frugal. So um, first and foremost, we're going to try to have an inexpensive wedding when we have money set aside. Don't know when or where that looks like, but yeah. uh, probably in the next uh, year or so. We're not going to do the traditional one year. Um, we've been yeah. together for so long, y'all. It's just we're best friends, and I don't know that a ceremony is going to do any more for us. For yeah. us. So um, we we're just kind of taking it at our own stride. And yeah, our parents aren't out. paying for it, so we're going to put it out there. Our parents are not paying for this wedding whatsoever. Right. So it's coming out of our pockets. We want to be very smart. And the main thing for us is that we want people to have fun. I don't want that wedding where it's very stuffy. And I don't want the wedding where it's like a Jersey Shore club scene. I want a happy medium. And so we're going to plan it all ourselves. And we're going to do a lot of DIY, obviously. And we just want to take our time. We don't yeah. want to feel rushed. And that'll be fun to do videos. Yeah, if we do anything like wedding specific, we'll try to post. But again, no Brizilla stuff. You're not going to get that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank God. Can you see, can, are they going to be allowed to see more footage? Yeah, and it's not really about allowed. I mean, it's just a lot of things in our lives we obviously do share on, you, on here with you guys and on social media, and some things you just want to keep private. And, of course, that was, like, a really special moment for me, and, you know, my real emotions were on camera, and I don't know necessarily if I want to go ahead and just post that right away. So Maybe a snippet or something. Yeah, right? maybe a snippet. If you guys do follow us I on Instagram. Somebody, I got yeah, something to record it. But if you guys do follow follow us on Instagram, I made like a really quick slideshow on there that you guys can watch um, for the time being. But we're still just deciding how much we want to share and how we want to share that with you guys. So stay tuned for that. Yeah. So what else? I think that's it. Can you we owe them some else? videos. So we gotta, I yeah, know. We're, we're just terrible. We're just like, we don't even know why you guys still watch it. We're so terrible. But I promise we'll post it. Again, we've just been so busy and... You know, having to catch up with family and friends here that knew you we were engaged, and that's kind of number one. And then we wanted to share it with you guys. So I'm glad you guys have been so patient and hanging out with us. You know, we've seen we've gotten some more subscribers, and we haven't even been online. So we love you guys so much. Thank Thanks you. For the support. It's been a big month for us. Yeah, but we're glad we're back. Um, probably do a DIY in the next video. Ask them. What, whatever y'all would like to see, please put it in the comments. It can be related to the engagement or completely different, but we're still trying to gauge what y'all want to see. We noticed that uh, these videos where we sit down and talk, they get a lot more. They do really well. Yeah, they do a lot more, uh, get a lot more hits. Yeah. Views and <laughs> likes and comments, which reminds me, please rate, comment, and, and like this subscribe. video and subscribe. If you're not. To our channel, yeah. Yeah, but if there are any more, you know, specific, like, bride-related stuff, if anything, that would be on my channel separately, because I don't want to bog this channel down with that type of stuff. But any additional questions, I'll put on there for you guys. The girly yeah. stuff. But besides that, like I said, we're glad to be back. We're engaged. If you guys have any comments, put them below. And we'll see you all next time. That's it. Yeah. Thanks Thank for watching, you. guys. <laughs> Bye.